What type of background do you have when it comes to playing games when you were younger? Well, I don't want to really say how old I, I, I am, but I'm actually 56. I was born in 1957, and so when I was a kid, there, were, there wasn't anything called a video game. When Pong came out, it was awesome. It was awesome, right? And um, and the thing I loved, you know, about the games is the is the way that you could interact. If the more that you could just directly interact with the game, the more fun it was, you know. And and I think that that as I had children, I have five sons, and they got into video games, and they were the prime ages for the in, during the development of video games, and. I tell you, you know, it was so much fun seeing them, you know, play the games and seeing it through their eyes. And I remember, you know, when they were really young, and I was, I was a young animator, um, you know, Donkey Kong and Dig Dug, and those era of games came out, and they were, they were cartoony, and they had fantastic animation and stuff, and it was just the gameplay was funny. You know, and fun, and the storytelling was fun, and that's what really got me excited about the video games is that extension of it. And then as we played with the family, we you know, uh, with taking the Mario World and Mario Karts and Super Smash Brothers, the, the mashup of all those things, and the boys have really gotten in the first-person shooter games and the quest games, you know, and on and on and on. It was really great, and it's been so exciting to see the tremendous advancement of how great video games look. And now I don't play, I just sit back and watch my sons play because they're so good at it, they've grown up with it. And it's just so entertaining for me. And I, but I'm also, my wife always says, John, you're directing again. Because I go, go over there. No, 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 go that. You know, it is really, it's really fun. Dad, get out of here. It's our game. So through your own kids playing games, um, you see that game playing is a big role in the entertainment franchise today? Mm-hmm. Well, I, I mean, I love creating stories and movies and anime films with great characters and really entertaining people. Um, and it, it's really exciting to have, um, you know, video games in the, in the interactive world to be an extension of that because it's, it just it makes it so we can expand our um, our worlds and, and what we can do with our characters. And that's what's exciting. And they, I'm so excited about Disney Infinity. What excites you about the direction and opportunity video games are opening up today? Well, I think Disney Infinity, it's hard to even call it a video game because it's so different. What excites me about this is how it's going to it puts more and more of what happens in the game into the hands of the user. It's up to them. Right? Now you can play it to where it's just everything's laid out for you, there's a quest, there's the world you play in there and all that stuff and then it's really fun to do that. You know, but there's also this other side where it's like, what do you want to do today? It's completely up to you. And I think that's what's so exciting of, uh, and I think it's going to take the whole, the whole game industry into this this new place, especially with bringing together all of the Disney and Pixar characters in, uh, you know, in one place that you can play with. And that is so um, fresh and original and it's very exciting.